Hey everybody, it's Mike Hansen, and this month I'm coming to you from Zephyr Hills, Florida. I'm here visiting my parents with my family, and I want to show you some easy ways that you can get a golf-specific exercise in even while you're traveling. So check out these awesome exercises. Okay, so what I look for in a program is I want to get my heart rate up, so you can do laps around or you can do some type of running or exercise like that. And then I look for some strength exercises and then some power exercises and then some movement and then also some mobility. So for some, just so for some movement exercise, we're gonna do some pelvic rotation. So I do 15 of these each side, trying to keep my upper body stable and then turn each side. And then I wanna do some pelvic tilts just to understand, get my pelvis moving this way especially great if I'm gonna start playing some golf today. And then the other thing I wanna do is move my shoulders. So I'm just gonna do this, get my shoulders moving just a little bit, just to get warmed up. And then I wanna add in some squats. Squats are a great way to get some lower body strength this way. And then if I wanna get my heart rate up or add some power into it, I can use some, some squat jumps, just like that. The other thing that are really good that's gonna help your golf game are some lunges where you can lunge down and then you can add a rotation. So we're gonna lunge and a rotation. And just remember, you don't wanna get your knee too far out in front of you when you do that lunge. And then for some upper body strength, we're gonna do some push-ups. Really easy way to just to do some push-ups like this. You can do some one leg push-ups because when you do them that way, your body is trying to rotate and then you're gonna resist it with your core. So those are some strength and power exercises that you could do. And then for some more upper body strengthening exercises, I really like the T's and Y's. These are great when you don't have any equipment that you need for resistance. Is you can do the T's and then the Y's. Just bringing your arms. The main thing on this one is you wanna keep your arms as straight as you can and stay in that posture so you don't come out of posture. So you're gonna lift up for a Y, so it looks like this, more straight up this way, and then a T is straight out, squeezing that upper back. It's really great for upper back and upper body strength exercises. And then we wanna add some balance things in. So these are my two favorite for balance, is to stand on one leg, and then you're gonna rotate. So you're gonna rotate into that leg, and then you can also rotate away from that leg. That's a really good one for balance. And then the other one is a single leg where you, you're gonna stand on one leg and you're just gonna reach down with your opposite hand. Trying to keep your, the leg that's on the ground pretty straight. You're just gonna do it that way and straight down like that. And another way, if you don't have any resistance, is sometimes if you have a small child, you can, you can use them as well. So we can use her for curling exercises where you're just gonna use her this way for a curl you can also push her over your head this way another couple of things that you can do is use her for rotation like you're gonna just rotate this way and then you can also use her for if you're gonna do like a, a medicine ball throw and you can just throw her this way so innovative ways and ways that you can think of to get an exercise in is a really good way to increase your strength while you're on vacation and keep your golf game where it needs to be. Okay, and we always wanna make sure we work on the core. So some of the best exercises for the core, and I think this is one of the easiest things to do, is always a plank. You can always do a plank. So we're gonna get down on the ground, just elbows and toes this way, and then you're just gonna hold that for a prescribed amount. Or you can do um, single arm and single leg. I really love these because they're anti-rotation and then you can rotate out this way. You can also go opposite. So you can always make it a little bit harder. Some just some great things that you can do while on vacation. All right guys, so those are just some things that you can do really simple while you're on vacation or if you're traveling to play golf, you can get those little things in without equipment. It's sometimes it's fun. All you need to do is try and get your heart rate up do some, do some sets and repetitions. I like to plan all my stuff out before and just not kind of go on a whim, but you can try and do, so what you're trying to plan on is just some movement things, some mobility things, some, and then some strength, and if you can, get some power things in, if you can handle those. Those are great for your golf game. So 
I hope you have a great 2019 and I want to tell you about my off-season golf specific fitness program. If you're interested, visit offseasongolf.com and if you want to buy the program and save 50%, just put SC Golf Media in the promo code. That's SC Golf Media in the promo code and you're going to save 50% for being a subscriber to the SC Golf Magazine.